Hi there, this is Matt Harper here at John Hinder Honda. I'm going to make a video on the Honda's Lane Keeping Assist System and the Adaptive Cruise Control. And I'm going to show you where the sensors are for these and then I'll show you how it works inside the vehicle while driving. So you've got the sensor in the bottom of the grill here for the Adaptive Cruise Control. It's going to be sending radar systems out to the signals out to the vehicles in front of us and then you've got your lane keeping assist camera here on the windshield on the back side of the rear view mirror and let's jump in the car and i'll show you how they work inside the car here you can see you've got the buttons to the left of the steering wheel down underneath of the economy mode button the one on the left is going to be the lane keeping assist and the one on the bottom right is going to be the collision mitigation braking system. These are the manual overrides for these features where you can actually turn the feature on and off. Here on the steering wheel are going to be your main uh, buttons for the adaptive cruise control and the lane keeping assist. To engage the system you'll turn it on by pressing main once you press main, you'll see the ACC and the LKAS pop up on the information display. By pressing the lane keeping assist button, you see the two lanes appear on both sides of the screen. Those lanes will turn uh, white or they will fill in once it's out on the, the vehicle's out on the road and it's detecting lanes. This button is your adaptive cruise control button by pressing it it's going to set the adaptive cruise control, which it's, it's not going to stay on. I'm going to have to keep pressing it because I'm not driving down the road. I'm going to pull out onto the road here so I can show you exactly how these features work. So to turn on the system, we're going to hit the main button. And on the dash, it's going to say ACCLKAS. If I hit the lane keeping assist button, the button with the steering wheel and hands on it, there's a, the camera is now looking out ahead of us. It can see the solid line and the dotted line. If I were driving down the road now, say I'm driving down the highway and I start to drift off, it is going to uh, notify me by shaking the steering wheel. It will beep, but it will try and keep you on the road. So say I'm driving down the road, the road clearly turns here. You can see the steering wheel is turning and it is doing everything it can just to keep me into the middle lane without me having to actually touch the steering wheel. The system's not meant to drive for you. It's only meant to be a safety feature if you're driving down the highway. On the, there it's, it's giving me the, the warning that my hands are off the wheel. Now it knows my hands are on the wheel, it'll stop beeping. But I am pacing with the semi truck in front of me with the adaptive cruise control this button here with the car and the three lines behind it. Once the radar is sensing the vehicle in front of me, it, there's a solid car icon that pops up on the dash. As I hit this button, it'll allow me to follow closer or it will allow me to follow further back. The lane keeping assist system knows to turn itself off when the blinker is turned on. If you have any other questions about these systems, please feel free to give me a call. Again, this is Matt Harper at John Hinder Honda, the number 740-522-1106. Thanks for watching.